It's time to mark your attendance. So all of you, mark your attendance now. All of you. All of you, mark your attendance now. Okay, did you mark your attendance? Did you mark your attendance? Okay, good morning all of you. How are you? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Okay, I think. Good morning. I think we have finished our last chapter. That is the Southern Plateau and Island, isn't it? നമ്മള് കംപ്ലീറ്റ് ചെയ്തില്ലേ ആ ചാപ്റ്റർ എല്ലാ ആക്ടിവിറ്റീസും നമ്മൾ ചെയ്തില്ലേ ആർക്കും ഓർമ്മയില്ല കഴിഞ്ഞ ക്ലാസ്സിൽ പഠിച്ച ചാപ്റ്റർ പോലും ഓർമ്മയില്ല ഓക്കെ Okay, tell me, what are the remaining activities? What are the remaining activities? E, E. Okay, activity E and E. the remaining activities okay so activity e all of you listen page number 263 activity e that is write the names of the states where the following are situated it's a simple activity and it is a homework okay you have to write the state to which these places belong ee ore place me the state la anulladu adana avade ezhudanad okay so do this as a homework and there is a map for activity g mark and label the following on the map of india given on page number 276 miss okay attendance yes mark your attendance all of you should mark your attendance mark your attendance and that is a very very important yes. thing okay yes sir yes tell me ഇന്ത്യ ലുക്ക് ലക്ഷദ്വീപ്ലാൻഡ്സ് River Godavari. We have to mark all these places in that map. Okay. That is also another number. Any doubt? Any doubt? Miss F G H. Okay. You don't need to do the H. Now we are going to the F. Okay. That is F. It is an information gathering. Okay. Okay. All of you listen here. M S Dhoni, the famous cricketer, is from Ranchi. It is Jaffar. Work in pairs and find out five. You have to find out five interesting facts about. Okay, I think I have to tell you. 
മാപ്പ് വർക്ക് അറിയില്ലേ മാപ്പ് വർക്ക് എന്ന് പറഞ്ഞാല് ഇവിടെ കുറെ പ്ലേസസ് വന്നിട്ടില്ലേ ഈസ്റ്റേൺ ഗട്ട്സ് വെസ്റ്റേൺ ഗട്ട്സ് സതേൺ പ്ലാറ്റൂസ് ലക്ഷദ്വീപ് അതൊക്കെ തന്നിട്ടില്ലേ അതൊക്കെ ആ മാപ്പില് എവിടെയാണ് നിങ്ങൾ കണ്ടുപിടിച്ച് മാർക്ക് ചെയ്യാം അത് എളുപ്പല്ലേ ഒന്നുകൂടെ പറയണോ ആരാധ്യ പ്രസന്റ് ഇട്ടില്ല ആരാധ്യ പ്രജിത് കനു ഗ്യാമി കോളേജസ് then the award he has won his favorite food his hobbies his favorite sports person and do this activity f as a project okay you can do this activity f as a project so all of you listen here activity e and g are homework and activity f it is a project for you and you should submit the response sir before the next monday okay you have one week time submit me the homework within one week before the next monday okay any doubt no okay and there is another thing that you have an exam tomorrow or to me have an exam so all of you study well and write the exam mr ravi ana ratri ana uh evening 7 pm evening 7 pm okay jaane raatre tomorrow okay endana parnolu ite naale exam yes naale naale evening 7 o'clock ina exam morning il exam endana mettilla pedikkanda ippu evening il exam undavu kota so all of you study well and score well okay So shall we go to the last chapter? Google Meet la. Uh, Google Meet la. No. Okay, I don't know about Google Meet. I don't know about the written exam. I don't know about the written exam. I don't know about the written exam. Okay. So shall we go to the new lesson? That is the last lesson of this term. Where is there now? Social. Yes. What is the yes. name of this chapter? Our last chapter? Okay. Emperor Akbar. Emperor Akbar. Emperor Akbar. And who is this Akbar? Who is this Akbar? Akbar was ruled in, in India. Yes. He was the ruler of India. and do you know his full name akbar is his short name like okay i will akbar. tell you okay tell me if anyone knows his name you can tell now full name are you akbar inde now okay i will tell that is his full name is abul fat jalal ഉദീൻ മുഹമ്മദ് അക്ബർ ആബുൽ ഫത് ജലാൽ ഉദീൻ മുഹമ്മദ് അക്ബർ ആൻഡ് ഹീസ് നോൺ ബൈ ദ നെയിം അക്ബർ ഹീസ് ദ ലാസ്റ്റ് നെയിം അക്ബർ എന്നാണ് അറിയപ്പെടുന്നത് ഫുൾ നെയിം വലിയൊരു നെയിം ആണ് അബുൾ ഫത് ജലാൽ ഉദ്ദീൻ മുഹമ്മദ് അക്ബർ ദറ്റ് ഈസ് ഹിസ് ഫുൾ നെയിം ആൻഡ് ഹി വാസ് ദ തേർഡ് മുഗൾ എംപറർ ഓക്കെ ഹാവ് യു ഹാർഡ് അബൌട്ട് ദ മുഗൾ ഡൈനാസ്റ്റി മുഗൾ ഡൈനാസ്റ്റി Have you heard about that? 
Yes or no? Yes or no? Have you heard about this Mughal dynasty? It is not given in your textbook. Okay, tell me. Okay, have you heard about Mughal dynasty? That is my question. Have you heard about this dynasty? Mughal dynasty means uh, a group of kings who ruled over the India for uh, many years. Muslim kings are in the rule of the Avadi Auru, Vamsatin and the Mughal dynasty in the Varanuda. Okay. So, and this Akbar belonged to the Mughal dynasty. Okay. And he was the third emperor of this Mughal dynasty. Okay. We don't need to worry about this Mughal dynasty. Okay. And what is the difference between an emperor and a king? Or what do you mean by an emperor? What do you mean by an emperor? What is the meaning of this word emperor? Yes, yes. Alan Matthew, any idea? Chakravarti. Yes, Chakravarti. Very good. And what is the difference between an emperor and a king? Whether both are same? A king and emperor, both are same? King and emperor. Okay, Alan. King and emperor. Yes, very good. Emperor has the high. Very good, Alan. That is the difference between king and an emperor. Emperor has the highest position and highest rank. Highest rank compared to a king. So he is always higher than a king. That is, he is the king of kings. That is emperor. So our Akbar is also an emperor. Akbar was an emperor. Okay. And in this chapter, we are going to study about this emperor. That is the third emperor of Mughal dynasty. Emperor Akbar. Okay. And there is a small activity given in your textbook. That is, circle the names of kings who ruled in India. Have to find out the names of the kings who ruled in India. The first one, Peter the Great. Whether he was the king of India? Do you think whether he was the king of India? Say yes or no? Say yes or no? Don't worry about the mistakes. Let it be right or wrong. Don't worry about that. Just say yes or no. Whether he was yeah. the king. Yes. yes, 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 very good. Peter the Great was not an Indian king, he was an Russian. He was a Russian emperor. Emperor. Okay. Then Ashoga. Ashoga. Whether he is an Indian king or not. Ashoga. Yes. Very good. Yes. Very good. Yes. Very good, very good. Ashoga. So circle around Ashoga. Ashoga, he was an Indian king. So all of you circle Ashoga. Aradha Prajit, can you hear me? Okay, then circle Ashoga in your textbook. Okay, who is this Vini? Who is this? Vini Nala Pedal Karidara Nuda. Change your name, okay? Change your name. Change your name and mark your attendance again. Okay. So next person, Alexander. Who was he? An Indian king? Or no? No. Yes. He was a Greek king. So Alexander the Great. He is not an Indian king. Then Darius. An Indian king or not? Darius. No. Yes, he was a Persian king. Next, Akbar. An Indian king or not? Yes. Yes, very good. Because in this chapter, we are going to study about this Emperor Akbar. So Akbar, he, is an, he was an Indian king. So circle Akbar also. 
Sak. Shaumadi. Oh. The class. Okay. Then circle Akbar. Circle Akbar. Okay. Then next one. Porous. Porous. Yes. No. Okay. Wait. Porous. I think you don't know about this king. Porus, he was an ancient Indian king. Porus was an ancient Indian king. So, circle Porus also. Porus, we have to Indian king. We have to So, circle the Porus. Okay. Circle the Porus. Okay. Circle the Porus. Then the next one, Shivaji. Yeah. Yes. yes. Shivaji. He was yes. Uh, yes, Shivaji was an Indian ruler, king. So circle Shivaji also. All of you circle Shivaji. Circle Shivaji. Sella El Sabatanile. Okay, then circle Shivaji. Then the next one. Okay, we need not a pale curry in Aram and the Miss Nord Variava. Pale Variava Erica Dunyos and Oja. Okay, Eric. Okay, no problem. Then the next one, Tipu Sultan. Tipu Sultan. Is that? Yes. Yes, Indian yes. king. Very good. Yes. Yes, he belongs to the Mysore kingdom. Mysore kingdom. So, circle Tip Sultan also. Okay, the next Raja Raja Sola. Raja Raja Sola. Brother? Yes. Yes, Raja yes. Raja Sola. He is also, he was also an Indian king. Belongs to the Chola Empire. Empire. Okay. He was a, he was a, he was a, a Chola Emperor. That is Raja Raja Chola. So circle Raja Raja Chola also. Next one, Shrengis Ghar. Shrengis Ghar. Yeah. 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 Okay. Shrengis Khan. Actually, when we hear the name, Peri Ekumanam Kapetan, the Indian animal tournament, actually, he is not an Indian king. He belongs to the Mongolo Empire. That is a Chinese king. So, Chinggis Gan, he is not an Indian king. He was not an Indian king. Next one, Nero. 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 Yes. No. He is also a Russian, sorry, Roman emperor. Nero. The last one, Ranjit Singh. Ranjit. Yes. 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 Ranjit Singh. He, is all, he was also an Indian king. And he is known as, he is known as Lion of Pancha. He is known as Lion of Pancha. Okay, so Sartre Rendit Singh also. So now, um, Johanna. Okay, can you read the names of Indian kings from this box that we are, that we circled now? Can you read the names of Indian kings that we found out, that we found now? Okay, unmute and say. The names of Indian kings from this box. Johanna ki mansnai le, Mr. Jolsda. Unmute down le. Okay, then Naomi, can you say? 
Ashoka. Yes. Then? Akbar. Okay. Akbar. Okay. Poros. Yes. Shivaji. Yes. Tipu Sultan. Tipu Sultan, okay. Raja. Raja Raja Chola. Then? Raja Raja Chola. Then? Ranji. Ranjit Singh. Ranjit Singh. So these are the names of the Indian kings. Okay, love the correct one. Okay, then let's go to this chapter. Akbar, he was one of the greatest rulers of India. And he ruled over a large empire. And he is often called Akbar the Great. And he was known by the name Akbar the Great. Okay, Akbar the Great. Then Akbar was born in 1542 to the Mughal Emperor. Humayun and his queen Hamida Banu B. And the name of his father is Humayun and his mother Hamida Banu B. And his father, that is Humayun, he was also an Mughal emperor. He was also a Mughal emperor. Okay, that is the second Mughal emperor. Then he was only 14 years when he became the ruler. So just think about his age. When he became the ruler of the ruler of his kingdom. Okay, that is, he was only 14 years when he became the ruler of his kingdom. And he ruled over India for nearly 50 years from 1556 to 1605. That was his ruling period. That is a nearly 50 years from 1556 to 1605. Okay, and this Akbar, our emperor, who was known by the name Akbar the Great. He is known by the name Akbar the Great. And he was born in 1542 as a son of Mukal Emperor Kumayor and Hamida Banu Bika. Okay, and he was just 14 years old when he became the ruler of India and he ruled over nearly 50 years. Okay, and I will show you a small photo of this Mukal, a small photo that's showing the various emperors in this Mughal dynasty. Okay, wait. Okay, can you see this image now? This means... Okay, all of you look here. This is Babar. That is the first Mughal emperor. So after his death, this Humayun became the next emperor. And Humayun, after Humayun, our Akbar, Akbar became the next emperor. That is the third emperor of this Mughal dynasty. The next one is Jahangir. And Jahangir, he is the son of this King Akbar. Akbar and the son of Jahangir. So Akbar Matishesham, Jahangir is the emperor. So after Jahangir, Shah Jahan. Shah Jahan became the uh, one, two, three, four. Ah, yes, the fifth emperor of this Mughal dynasty. And this is the Aurangzeb. He was the sixth and the last emperor of this Mughal dynasty. So it's a family tree of this Mughal emperors. The first Mughal emperor was Babur. Then the second, Himayun. The third is the Akbar. The fourth one is Jahangir. Then the fifth one, Shah Jahan. And finally, the last Mughal emperor is Aurangzeb. Okay. This is their family tree. Okay, family tree means that showing their father, sons, etc. Okay, this is our family tree. We will have a family tree of kings in the photo. Emperors in the photo. Okay, any doubt? No, miss. Okay. 
Okay, then Akbar the conqueror. What do you mean by the word conqueror? Conqueror. What do you mean by the word conqueror? What will be the meaning of that word? In the item, Alan, any idea? Conqueror. Conqueror. He conquered the world. He conquered many nations. Conquered. Conquered means yes. Kira dakka. Namala akramichi kira dakka arla yudhangal lude. Adi naane conquering na varida. So conqueror na varna langane akramichi kira dakki jaychi varal. So Akbar the conqueror. Langane irbari yudhangal nadi jaychi varal an Akbar. So Akbar ne adi ne auru jayte kurushana namale bada parayi bata. That is Akbar the conqueror. Akbar built a large empire. He defeated many rulers. He defeated many rulers through wars. Okay, and some of them were him, the general of the Afghan forces at the Second Battle of Panipat. He defeated him. The next was Rani Durga, the Gond Vi. Then the next one, Maharana Pradap of Meva at the Battle of. Haldi Gadi, Maharana Pradab of Meva at the Battle of Haldi Gadi. Next, Shanti, the ruler of Ahmadnagar. So all of you said, he moved the general of Afghan forces at the Second Battle of this Panipat. He defeated this Kimu. Then he defeated Rani Durga Gadi. He defeated Maharana Pradab. He defeated Shanti Gadi. Okay, and like that, he defeated many rulers. And became the conqueror, the Akbar the Great. Okay, any doubt? Any doubt? Do you have any doubt? No. Okay, so let's go to the. No, it's not over. So let's take the next page, one ninety four. Page one ninety four. Yes, the Rajput. Rajput means it's a group of people. It's a Mixture of so many people belong to the different caste. A uh, group of people sharing some common social status. But a group of people under Rajasthan and Narana group of people under Rajputs. No matter what, Akbar no time. Okay, the Rajputs ruled in Rajasthan. Okay, Akbar tried to get their support, so he treated them with respect. Now, what are you doing? So, what are you doing? അതുപോലെ നമ്മുടെ അക്ബർ കിങ്ങിന് രാജസ്ഥാനിലുള്ള രാജ്പുരുഷന്റെ സപ്പോർട്ട് വേണമായിരുന്നു സോ ഇൻ ഓർഡർ ടു ഗെറ്റ് ദപ്പോർട്ട് ഓഫ് ദി സപ്പോർട്ട് ഓഫ് ദിസ് രാജ്പുട്സ് റൂൾഡ് ഇൻ രാജസ്ഥാൻ അവർക്ക് റെസ്പെക്ട് കൊടുത്തു ഒരുപാട് ആൾക്കാരെ കല്യാണം കഴിക്കായിരുന്നു ഇപ്പത്തെ പോലെ അല്ല സോ ഹി മാരീഡ് രാജ്പുട്ട് പ്രിൻസസ് പ്രിൻസസ് രാജ്പുട്ട് അക്ബർ മേഡ് ഹിസ് എംപയർ സ്ട്രോങ് ആൻഡ് സ്റ്റേബിൾ യെസ് ഫ്രം ദിത്ത് ഹെൽപ്പ് ഓഫ് ദിസ് രാജ്പുട്ട് ഓർ ബൈ ദപ്പോർട്ട് ഓഫ് ദിസ് രാജ്പുട്ട് Akbar made his empire strong and stable. So, this help from or the support from this Rajput who ruled in India, sorry, who ruled in Rajasthan, helped him a lot for expanding his empire. Okay, and here you can see the pictures of some famous person. That is William Shakespeare was an English playwright. Next, Ivan the Terrible, the King of Prussia. Queen Elizabeth I, the ruler of England, then Galileo Galilei, Italian astronomer, and he was the person behind the telescope. Telescope for country which are person and the number Galileo Galilei. Okay, then Sir Tulasida, he was an Indian poet, and this person also lived during his age. Akbar ne time mila number the world le under the famous person Sani Birakhe. And you will study about this person in your higher classes. Okay, then let's summarize today's class. 
okay in this class we discussed about akbar that is the third mughal emperor and he was often called akbar the great and he was born in 1542 to the mughal emperor as a son of humayun of uh, to the mughal emperor humayun and his we amida banu begum that is the name of his father is humayun and his mother amida banu begum and he was just 14 years when he became the king of india and he ruled over 40 sorry he ruled over 50 years that is from 1556 to 1605 this he ruled over india nearly 50 years 50 varsha nammada akbar nammada india rule cheyidu that is from 1556 to 1605 that was his ruling period okay and he defeated many kings many rulers in different wars and they are him that is general of afghan forces at the second battle of panipat next rani dudgavan he defeated the rani dudgavan the golden king then he defeated maharana pratap of mewar at the battle of kalgadi then he defeated shan bibi the ruler of ahmad nagar okay these are the names of the king defeated by our emperor akbar okay next there was a ruling group it is rajput in rajasthan so he did he did that the support of his rajput so he decided to support the to give respect and give it higher positions and higher power and by marry the rajput princess okay and he offered all these things to this rajput people and thereby the help of this thereby by the help of this rajput in rajasthan this he could expand his empire and he could make his empire strong and stable rajput in the headquarter rajasthan ulla rajput in the headquarter kudi nammada akbar akbar in the kingdom adu stable aki strong okay shahma we do you have any doubts miss a bhayangara sound aite parayunnathu onnum manasilavunnilla okay ellavarkkum angane aanu onnum theriyunnilla clear avunnilla miss parayunnathu manasilavunnundo is there any problem yes yes miss hello kekkunnunde okay shahma do you have any all clear la kekkunnu okay shahma do you have any network miss clear illa ാണോ ഓഡിയോ സിസ്റ്റം എന്തെങ്കിലും അവിടെ നിന്ന് നിങ്ങളുടെ സ്പീക്കറോ അല്ലെങ്കിൽ ഫോണിന്റെ സ്പീക്കറോ ലാപ്ടോപ്പിന്റെ സ്പീക്കറോ എന്തെങ്കിലും പ്രോബ്ലം ഉണ്ടെന്ന് ചെക്ക് ചെയ്യണം കാരണം ബാക്കിയുള്ളവർക്ക് പ്രശ്നമില്ലല്ലോ അപ്പൊ അത് ഇവിടുത്തെ പ്രശ്നം അല്ല മേ ബി യുവർ പ്രോബ്ലം ഓക്കെ ദിസ് ഈസ് അബൌട്ട് അവർ ടുഡേസ് ക്ലാസ് ആൻഡ് യു ഹാവ് എനി ഡൗട്ട് റിഗാർഡിംഗ് ദിസ് ക്ലാസ് ഡു യു ഹാവ് എനി ഡൗട്ട് ഡു യു ഹാവ് എനി ഡൗട്ട് no okay then it's time to wind up our class okay we have only one minute remaining it's time to wind up our class so see you in the next class bye have a nice day bye See in the next class. Bye. Okay, before that, attendance master, see you after master, see you in the next class. Okay, bye. Have a good day. Thank you, miss. Bye. Bye, y'all. Bye. Have a nice day. Bye. Thank you, miss.
Okay, study where for the tomorrow's exam. Study where and for where. Okay. Okay, bye. Bye, Miss. Bye, y'all. Thank <laughs> you.